All right, hey guys, in this Hogwarts Legacy Guide video, I'm going to share with you how to solve all different types of Merlin Trials in the game. I believe there to be only eight different Merlin Trials, but if I'm missing one, please let me know down in the comments. So the first one I want to show you is the one that confused me the most, and it's this one, the rotating blocks on top of stone columns. You'll need the spell Flip Endo for this one. The trick is to look at the blocks at an angle so you're seeing two faces. Use Flip Endo on either side to rotate the block until the images match the fixed images on the stone column that the rotating block sits on. Flipping one side rotates the image for the other. You may have to position your character to look at the block from different angles, but most of the time, you shouldn't have to. For this one, use Revelio to locate the swarm of glowing flies, go to the swarm, use Lumos near them to attract them to your wand light, then travel to one of the blocks surrounding the Merlin Trial Circle. The hardest part of this one is locating the swarm of flies, so make sure to use Revelio. Having the talent that expands Revelio range comes in handy. For this one, like with all Merlin Trials, start out with Revelio to find out what you're dealing with. For this one, you must use Wingardium Leviosa, the blue spell, on the large rolling ball to get it into the hole in the ground that's somewhere nearby. Usually, it'll be down a track or some easily spotted, obvious path. For this one, all you have to do is use Revelio to locate the pillars and use Confringo on them to destroy them. For this one, you must find and locate the spheres hidden around you and blast them with basic cast. Use Revelio to locate them initially. There is no time limit on this one, and some of them are very well hidden. For this one, you'll notice white blocks with vines on them when you begin the Merlin Trial. The trick is to jump from one white block surface to the next without touching the ground or anything else, meaning you have to jump from one to the next. This one can get tricky. This one is perhaps the easiest one of them all, just use Revelio to find broken pieces of statues and use Reparo on them. There should be like three in total around the Merlin Trial Circle.
And this one can get pretty tricky too. It's the fireballs on top of the lowering pillars. Use Revelio first to locate all three of the bowls. Then the trick of it is to position your character in the right area so that you can quickly use Confringo on all three bowls. There's a time limit here. On some of these, there is a definite fireball that you should Confringo first and then the other two. If this video was helpful to you, I'd appreciate a like. For more Hogwarts Legacy Guide videos, visit my channel and browse my playlist. If I've left out a Merlin trial, please let me know down in the comments. My name is Venice SGN. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out.